Higher and drier slopes have lichen communities where various lichens cover large areas that are windswept and generally snow-free in winter. Lichens are slow-growing. Tests using radioactive dating have found some lichen samples to be an estimated 4,500 years old. During the winter, lichens are the main food source for caribou. From spring through fall, caribou migrate through various tundra community types, eating grasses and sedges. The caribou is the major large herbivore of the Arctic. Caribou hair is hollow and thus highly insulating. It is put on or shed in layers as the seasonal temperatures change. Caribou numbers have declined from millions to a few thousands as its winter food sources have been drastically ruined by summer fires. The community energy cycle for the moist tundra is much more complex due to the larger variety of local community types and habitats present. It should be remembered that nearly all of the animal members are active both summer and winter. In winter, however, activity is slower to conserve energy. The third Arctic tundra type, the Arctic alpine tundra, occurs above the moist tundra and usually transitions from one to the other type with no sharp boundaries.